There we go. There we go. Second terminal. Let's see if this will be at all useful. Accessing second data fragment. Modifying decryption algorithm. This will, of course, be my final appearance at these gatherings, but the galaxy I leave behind. No voice print identification available. Reconstruction incomplete. So, no, not really useful. Oh, yes, yeah, some more droids. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, this way. The third terminal. It's a bit of a wreck, this place. Accessing third data fragment. Attempting playback. My sympathies. With the old man lost, the next enforcer will be difficult to train. Experiencing data corruption, we will hope the last fragment provides redundancy. We will hope that the last one is useful. Bye, bitches. The final terminal. Well, this is it. This is the whole shit. <laughs> Accessing fourth data fragment. Splicing now. Data. I am here. All is ready. The Creeper. <laughs> this is Keeper. Cypher, get out of there. Reinforcements are on the way, and there's nothing more you can do. Hunter's already there, though. <laughs> Creeper and Hunter. Wow. Well, um, what's the status? You're sure you have the full recording? Hard to be certain, but we think so. The Watchers will try to reconstruct the Holoconference back at headquarters. Come to Drum and Cars as soon as possible, and we'll figure out our next move. Keep it out. Drum and Cars? Use your ship to travel to Drum and Cars. Oh my god. I hate that. I hate that. Well, we can just go past these. What that means is that I can't go to my stronghold and exit to Drummond Cars. I can't do that. I have to go back onto my ship. I have to travel to Drummond Cars. And then once I'm there, I should be able to stronghold it. just completely unnecessary. It should just say go to the Imperial, whatever it's called, at the Citadel. It would avoid this completely unnecessary step. I guess it's RP friendly, but it is a waste of time. <laughs> Drama cars. Go to Imperial Intelligence Headquarters. Could have just said that. Oh, we're going down here, are we? Ah, finally! Conference room. Secure hollow room. Utilize fractal thought pattern 27. Reanalyze. Come in. They're reconstructing the conspirators' hollow conference now. Anything turn up so far? Preliminary analysis bears out our theory. The call was initiated by Hunter, somewhere in the Brema sector six months ago. The recording you pulled is intact, but... Watcher 9? Splicing and decryption complete. Rules of the Chorus Covenant, I call this meeting to order. Spare us the corporate posture and report. Since you're in a hurry, 
Senator Varala and Representative Shuru are predictable as always. And Commodore? All taken care of. What about you? Those earnest Padawans keeping you up at night? Different participants on different data streams. Processing. Look at them. Safe and secure. They think they rule the world. Who can blame them? Domain is unsettled, as we expected. I must again raise the concern. Do we overplay our hand? There is the chance it will spin out of control. Darth Angrel, Darth Barris, now the children are awakening. For each, there is a Republic counterbalance. We're letting loose the reins, but we're not taking off their blinders. Sit back and enjoy the spectacle. There's a Republic version of Darth Barras. <laughs> Don't tell me we're missing whole sections. To bicker. Each of us agreed to the timetable. Each of us reports success in our own sphere. Ambition must never be our master. Patience serves our noble cause best. But if our enforcer approves... I do. I swear. Then we move forward to Armageddon. Keeper? The War Council needs you. Sir? Ah! <laughs> it's funny because... This is all scripted weirdness, but it just looks like the game. It just looks like the game bugging out in the usual ways that it does. <laughs> Talk to me, Keeper. Look at me. We need security and a medical team. This is supposed to be weird, zany shit, but it's just normal because of how the game is. What's our status? Keeper and the others are on life support. Fixers theorized the transmission had a hidden overlay. A code or image only a genetically enhanced mind could recognize. Designed to overwhelm and shut down the brain. You said they're on life support. Any prognosis? Without understanding the trigger? They could be vegetables for hours or for decades. Losing this many analysts, forget about Keeper. It's going to be a blow to the war. I'll support you where I can, but right now I've got a few dozen field agents without handlers. Your operation. The people responsible for this should be our top priority. While you were on Belsavis, Keeper was compiling leads on the planet Voss. If you want to head there, I'll see what I can pull up. I've apprised the Minister of Intelligence. If he needs to contact you, he knows how. We right. still have a lead. We'll find the people responsible. Damn right we will, Bug Boy. Damn right we will. Travel O. Use the ship's hull terminal, and then we'll travel to Voss. Cypher, hope you don't mind my checking in. You weren't expecting any other calls. I've always got time for you. Why is the option there? Why is the option there? Do Bioware think that we will at all like him? Why are you contacting me, Hunter? Your visit to Mega Security Ward 23 left it in bad shape. Now do I come into your house and break your things? More like Kunta. Are you finding that hollow trap? Frying your keeper's synapses? That's kind of cosmic justice. Once I find you and your bosses, you won't be smirking anymore. Cypher, it's been fun. Playing tag, brainwashing you. Remember your keyword? But you keep coming, and we'll destroy your world. No friends. No allies. No empire left to fight for. Are you ready for that? <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> good luck with that. You're assuming I don't stop you first. This is Cypher 9 to crew. Prepare for takeoff. Alright, Kunta. Sure. Oh my god, everyone wants to speak again. Whoa, so many people now. My good friend, have you noticed that the price of Dianogan tea has risen considerably since we broke the Treaty of Coruscant? Uh, yeah, the sure. The costs of war you never anticipate. And now my jamming device is working, so we can dispense with the inanities. Beg your pardon? What jamming device? What are you talking about? 
just in case someone's monitoring us. Thanks to a now wealthy Kubaz information broker, I've identified the people who want me dead. They represent an organization called Project Protean, a secret research and development group inside the Imperial Science Bureau. What does Protean do? And what do they want? Protean researches practical applications of alien biology. You recall the genetically modified assassins who came after me? They're only the beginning. Imagine troops spliced with abyssin genes to enhance healing, or adrenals derived from Gamorian hormones. Most test subjects don't fare well, but you can see the potential. Can I? <laughs> can I? <laughs> that sounds awfully like what you were doing on Terrace. There's a great deal of interdepartmental rivalry in our work, and my research does overlap with theirs. They may have targeted me in order to ensure that they have no competition, inside or outside the Empire. This is your operation. What's our next step? Further study, I'm afraid. Right now, I'm unsure where the project is based or how to contact its members, but I wanted to keep you apprised. Now, about that Dianogan tea. Yeah, about that. What about that? <laughs> what about that? It's, it's canon that I just walked out and didn't let him finish. You. I've learned to access your culture's holographic network. Listen. Eighteen trillion desperate attempts to communicate per second. I hadn't realized your species were so starved for interaction. What have you discovered, sifting through those transmissions? I now understand your frustrations. I look at you and see neurons fire in your brain. I scan your body and know how you taste. Oh my. But you're blind, alone, and confused. If you're so far beyond biological creatures, what's the point of analyzing them? You dominate the galaxy. I'm curious, and do not sleep. Our time together has provided new information and sensations. These will prove useful in a future upgrade. All right. Sure. What's going on? Agent, in our work with the diplomatic service, we find ourselves talking to people we once knew. We've been contemplating this. Hello, Vector. It's Anora. I, I don't know if you remember me, but Bryson said he thought you would, and I wanted to talk to you. I know things didn't end well, but I never forgot. You need to get out of there. Come back to Drummond Cass and we'll get you help. We can undo what the Killix did. There are still people who care about you. We've watched it 17 times and meditated to the static. Well, she doesn't, clearly doesn't care enough to understand your connection to the Killix and that you actually like it and want it. You two used to be a couple. We were nearly engaged to Anora very long ago. We never considered that there are people who want us restored to what we were. But watching this, feeling nothing, we know we're no longer who we were when we loved her. People change, even without becoming part Killig. It's part of life. We think you're right, but we had to hear it from another. And we are content. Okay. Cool. Um, just Ensign Temple. To serve such a personage as you, Master. History will remember your name. Wish that dude would shut up. Something I can help you with, Ensign? I was hoping you could increase my security clearance, sir. At least long enough so I could know about my promotion. What promotion are we talking about? The top secret one, sir. I can only assume it occurred. I'm pleased to say that I finished, as best I can, putting myself through the Imperial Intelligence Training Regimen, save the psychological tests. With your help, I'm now almost qualified to be here. Thank you. 
There were psychological tests for Imperial Intelligence. How did Melora get through them? If you have more questions, feel free to ask. I was taught the best operatives figure it out for themselves. Right. Travel to Voss. Second to last planet. And quite a nice one. I don't mind going to Voss. Karelia after that is pretty poop. We know about Karelia. It's just empty. Lifeless. This is Watcher 3 to Cypher 9. Things are, are a little chaotic without Keeper, so I need a minute to pull our files on Voss. In the meantime, I did want someone more familiar, but... Ah! Apologies for the wait. Playing catch-up with our friends in the diplomatic service, but we think we can brief you. I didn't realize we had an expert on board. The diplomatic service has more experience with Voss than anyone. Certainly more than me. <laughs> we never served on Voss personally. It's a newly discovered world, home to a simple humanoid civilization. One species, one government, one city. Voss car. Primitive. They didn't even have spaceflight when we made first contact. But they have art and laws and culture. More importantly, they have citizens who can use the Force. Not Jedi or Sith, but something different. Art and culture? It's right up Bug Boy's alley. He's so he's so useful, our Bug Boy. So useful. Um You're going too fast. Tell me more about the Voss species. Their whole culture is based on solidarity. Loyalty and obedience to family. And to the edicts of the mystics. Those are the four sensitives, healers and fortune tellers. We want the Voss and the Mystics to ally with the Empire. The Republic is petitioning them, too, yet they remain stubbornly neutral. Of course, half the galaxy has spies there. Who wouldn't? Keeper's files clearly indicate conspirator involvement, but no names or details. All I've got are instructions for a meet. I'll take the bait. What was her plan? There's a tea house in Voskar proper. You're supposed to wait for a contact. He'll identify himself with the phrase, anew as the spring. I don't know who he is, or whether Keeper told him about the Star Cabal, but he'll know more than I do. Assuming he's in one piece. Assuming that, watch a three out. We'll await your instructions. Your instructions are to come with me. Sounds like you'll like this planet. Go to the tea house. Hey, Doctor, do you want to come along to the tea house? Voss and a, another orbital station for I don't know what reason no reason for no reason at all at least this planet's pretty though would would certainly like to be there right now but um no gotta go through gotta go through all of this this could uh could definitely have been a spaceport but no. No. A Voskar. Uh, regular quests. Who cares? All the way over the bridge. We're not being laggy in Voskar again, are we? The lag here was fixed during my Sith Warrior series. It seems okay. I'm getting some frame drops. What's this? A Vos lore object about the species, these colourful people, which are quite cool. Um, that is, uh, it's not us. All over here, that's a speed event, isn't it? Yeah. 
No, it's over here. There's a pretty cool building over here. Haven't actually been here for a quest before. Boss Trader. Judicial Quarter. Yeah. Looks like a Jedi Temple or something, doesn't it? What's this? Please wait. We have questions. We know nothing of you. Tell us the Empire's purpose here. Um. The galaxy is full of people who would try to take advantage of you. We won't let that happen. The Empire wishes to benefit us. We did not know. Do you know the Republic? Can you tell us about them? <laughs> the Republic will force your people to fight their losing war. You'll be destroyed. Disturbing words. Very disturbing. We will trust the wisdom of the three. But thank you for your knowledge. We will remember. Oh yeah. Wow, easy quest. <laughs> well, that was worth... <laughs> that was worth interacting with. We're just in this little building here. I'd forgotten that the Voss were extremely gullible. <laughs> oh, great. Bug boys are visible. Answer, please. Yanaton, remove incense for comfort. And pour the simple teas. Wait, hang on. Let's let's have Bug Boy be fully loaded. It's better. Outsider? Answer, please. Yanatan, remove incense for comfort. And pour the simple teas. We are honored. Don't burden the woman, Phaeton. She looked unburdened. I am Bastan. This is my tea house. Forgive my son. May we start anew as the spring? You're both... It, literally the same person. You're very kind. Is there somewhere we can talk? Most the others. This woman is a friend of a good friend. I will share her time. We'd like to see the city, if you don't mind. Maybe look up some friends in the diplomatic service. All right. Don't worry. The family won't bother us, and no one else suspects. Living with these creatures for five years earns some credibility. That's either quite a disguise, or your boss yourself. Our employers surgically altered me to look like the real Bass Tom. Wow. The only way to infiltrate a closed society. I got to know my family, raise children, kiss my wife. I don't care how exotic they look, their breath always smells like Minoc dung. Ugh. It's some spice in the blasted food. <laughs> Aside from their breath, is there anything else you've noted? I know their tics and their customs. More about their tea than I thought possible. Problem is, they're stagnant. A tea house owner is a tea house owner for life. The real politics are above my station. So, if I want to get involved in the real politics? They say the three run the government, and it's true. But a word from the mystics can change everything. My orders were to find you a lead on Albathius, a human who showed up a few years ago. Voss called him the Shining Man. Where he came from is a mystery, but it only took him five weeks to go from outsider to practically Voss. Went through a dozen rites to earn their respect, knew their culture inside and out, knew their politics, Textbook infiltration. Impossibly perfect. <laughs> Let me guess. No background, no known associates. Makes records disappear. We couldn't find a vid of him arriving on the planet, and you saw what security is like. Anyway, just when it seems the Voss can't love him anymore, he dies in his sleep, buried with honors, mourned like one of them. No one's touched the case much since. So if you want to learn what the Shining Man was up to, you've got a nasty job. Start with the tomb. You expect to find something with the body? Something the Voss buried. Something in the body itself. It's a place to start, anyway. Tombs at the base of the mountain, 
holiest place a non Voss can be interred. Predators keep the area clear these days. If you want to go in as a pilgrim, I've left clothes and instructions at a dead drop. Hmm. Give me a call once you're in. Theraton returns at sunset. Our family must prepare a welcome. We will speak again. Interesting. Seems like a, a bit of a weak lead. It is, of course, going to be exactly what we need. But <laughs> of course. Locate the dead drop. I wonder if this these these clothes will actually change our appearance. We'll have to see. We need to take a speeder. Where whereabouts, Sally? Just down there. I think that's where we went first on Silviso as well, isn't it? Oh, there's the bridge, damn it. God damn it. There's <laughs> someone in a flying chair. <laughs> so dumb, though. Vehicle pads are currently open for business. I might be slightly underleveled here. I'm not entirely sure. Saw some NPCs around were level 46. And we're 44. So we'll see. See if the mobs are 46. Won't be a problem for just our main quest though, of course. And I don't intend to be doing any heroics. So it should be fine. Taking this weirdly large shuttle through through a little <laughs> tiny little cave. <laughs> round trees. <laughs> not sure why it's this huge shuttle. And why it's not just a little speeder. Would have made a lot more sense. Never mind. Fort Cor Codentha. Okay. Um, let's see. Level 48. 47, 46. 48. I'm assuming that's a flashpoint. Yes, of course it is. The actual mobs. 44, 45. Okay, we're, we're, we're fine, it seems. 45. Yeah. Won't be long until we're 45. So we're keeping up. We're keeping up just about. Oh, over here. The dead drop. Uh, around this rock? Yes? No? Ah. You are holding a verse outfit, part of the pilgrim's ritual to the Shining Man's tomb. Best way to avoid drawing unwanted attention. Tradition says the pilgrim is supposed to collect ceremonial offerings from the Seeker's path. That'll be your first stop. Then the tomb itself. Just watch out for the subhumans. The Voss call them Gormak. But all you need to know is that they're vermin with blasters. Right. Um, so where's this outfit? These ropes, which I assume has changed our... Okay. We can't, we can't actually wear it. Alright. Okay. Sure. Never mind then. Never mind then. Never mind then. We have put, we, we put on a, a disguise using a mission item back on Hutter. It's possible, it's possible to do that in this game. They just decided not to, I guess. That's fine. What are we doing here? The stones? Love the mountain. Or... 
Stones of the Mountain. That's a... It's a oh, I see. Uh, we're going to be in range, aren't we? God damn it. <laughs> Having to kill two things. What an inconvenience. Stones of the Mountain. 